Silver Fleet. Working the harvest fields of the nation. On the hillside. In the rice fields. In the corn fields. On the great plains. Harvesting the bountiful crop lands of the nation. Until the job is done. Dependable performance. Quality performance from the great silver fleet of gleaners built by Alice Chalmers. These are the giants of the harvest, which have proven themselves throughout the years to be the leaders of the combine industry. From this great line of combines, there is a gleaner tailored to meet your requirements. The Model E, performance proved with big capacity from a 13-foot header is specifically designed to fit any diversified farming operation. The A2, which maintains its position as the flagship of the Great Silver Fleet, is now offering even greater capacity and performance with header capacity to 16 feet. The C2, which continues to lead in popularity with custom operators, the big wheat growers, and farmers with large diversified acreages with header capacity to 24 feet. The C8, the hillside special, always threshing on the level no matter what the slope. And the CR on tires or tracks equipped and built to stand up under the rugged conditions of the rice fields. No matter what the field, no matter what the crop, all gleaner models owe their superior performance to controlled threshing action, which is the result of the sure feed system with down front cylinder location. This exclusive sure feed system with retractable fingers on the auger and feeder beater combs and feeds the crop directly to the down front cylinder, which provides positive, uniform feeding, eliminates rattles and conveyors. The pivot point of the header and cylinder housing is to the rear of the cylinder. To maintain a constant feed angle regardless of the height of cut, thus full capacity of the cylinder is used. The exclusive down front cylinder design affords a longer and greater separating area than most other combines. Over 13 feet of separating length. Separation begins directly behind the cylinder where a wing type beater agitates the straw keeps it in suspension over the rattle where actually a major portion of separation takes place. A second wing type beater and a three section rotary walker completes the separating job. The top fan of the exclusive two fan system directs a heavy blast of air through the grain as it comes off rattle. It really pre-cleans. The lower fan directs a controlled volume of air to the adjustable chaffer and sieve of the cleaning shoe. More and cleaner grain in the bin is assured. Technicians, through the use of a high-speed motion picture camera, can show us what really happens as the crop goes through the threshing system. Motion has been slowed to one one-hundredth of normal speed. After the material is cut by the header, it travels only 15 and one-half inches to the cylinder and is controlled to within three quarters of an inch of the cylinder. The pivot point to the rear of the cylinder, because of its location, maintains a constant feed angle. Material is exposed to threshing action for the same length of time, regardless of header height or crop condition. The result? Maximum efficiency. From the cylinder, the crop goes to a wing-type beater, which thoroughly agitates and fluffs it as it is directed to the front separator. It is here that gleaner design affords threshing in depth as well as width and length. Material is kept in suspension as it passes through the front separator in a loose, fluffy manner. Grain and some of the chaff and dirt fall through the straw onto the cell conveyor below. And it is here that the majority of separation takes place, regardless of crop or condition. At the rear separator, another wing type beater again agitates and fluffs the straw as it moves onto the rotary straw walkers. The walkers shake and agitate the straw, 
to separate any remaining seed or grain as it moves rearward for discharge from the combine. The remaining grain thus separated is moved forward by the walker pans and is directed to the front of the cleaning shoe. At the end shaker type cleaning shoe, a controlled volume of air from the lower fan of the exclusive two fan cleaning system is directed through the material. Chaff is suspended as the grain falls through the adjustable chaffer and sieve to accomplish the final cleaning job. This method of threshing, separating, and cleaning assures more and cleaner grain in the bin, a method you'll find only in gleaner combines. The superiority of the gleaner threshing system was made to order to meet the demand for top performance in field picking and shelling of corn. Alice Chalmers engineers designed two, three, and four row attachments to fit all model gleaners. Here's proof of leadership. In 1962, thousands of farmers gathered at Grand Island, Nebraska to watch the national corn picking contest. State winners from all over the country met here to match their machines and abilities to determine the national corn picking champion. State winner from Michigan, Lawrence Fisher of Palmyra, entered the competition with his Model A gleaner, equipped with a two-row head. Fisher demonstrated his ability as top machinery operator, and at the same time, demonstrated that a gleaner can match the best of them in performance. At the Grand Island contest, Mr. Fisher scored 97.53 out of a possible 100 points. The highest score in contest history. In 1963, the following year, as with all national winners, Lawrence Fisher met his obligation to compete again. This time it was at Monroe, Wisconsin. Again, Lawrence piloted his Model A down the rows using all of his experience gained the previous year. He had learned his lesson well, and again, Fisher came in a winner, this time with 98.034 points to top his score of the previous year. Fisher was rightfully proud when he again received the championship trophy, which made him the only combine champion to win two years in a row. And he did it with a gleaner. Championship performance is gleaner performance. Whether it is a custom combining job on the Great Plains, corn harvesting in the Midwest, maize in the Southwest, pickup, or direct cut. Gleaner combines have earned the reputation for economical and quality performance because they are designed with quality construction throughout. Heavy all-welded mainframe has a foundation for true centerline design with quality components to assure minimum maintenance. Maximum flotation and traction enable your gleaner to keep going where others mire down. Easier handling with full control at all times. They unload on the go to save valuable time when you're racing the weather. The threshing system is proven superior. You've seen it work. You want it? Gleaner has it. Top performance. Today, Gleaner combines are bigger than ever with increased capacity to handle bigger yields and larger acreages. They will outwork and outthresh all others in any crop you want to harvest. Remember Gleaner. Remember that superior combine performance is yours with a combine from the Great Silver Fleet.